Hi everyone, I'm Naila Sayyid here and I am um, finally posting another video after a year. So yes, um, uh, it was a long break. I had a baby delivered which I was very busy with my baby. But I'm so happy to see so many subscribers uh, and it motivated me that I will make my next video very quickly. So here it is, chapter number three, pulses, जो page number seventy one में है, जैसे मैं हमेशा बताती हूँ कि I am referring a book, जो food science है, B. Shri Lakshmi का seventh edition, okay? So ये B. Shri Lakshmi का seventh edition है, तो you can also refer the same book, तो आप जब भी बैठे हो, ये ये video देखने के लिए, तो अगर आप book लेके बैठोगे, तो आप better understand करोगे. Okay, so firstly, thank you so so much uh, that you know you you kept on messaging uh, uh, my uh, you know the followers. Uh, you also followed me. Uh, it's amazing. So I'm going to continue uh, having more and more videos. And एक बार जब food science की book खत्म हो जाएगी, मैं dietetics पे भी जाने वाली हूँ. So it's all exciting for me. So good. So let's get started. So just now page number seventy one में जाइए and then we can start going forward. So what are pulses? Pulses are basically edible fruits or seeds of pod-bearing plants belonging to the family of leguminous. So pulses are basically belonging to leguminous. So if someone has told you that I want to add legumes in my diet, it is basically uh, he is referring to uh, pulses or uh, oil seed, but then you have to ask them specifically. Okay? इसमें एग्जाम्पल्स हो जाते हैं रेड ग्राम दाल बंगाल ग्राम दाल ब्लैक चना दाल एक्सेट्रा पीनट्स एंड सोयाबीन आर ऑल्सो इन द लेगुमिनस फैमिली ओके सो दीज आर ऑल्सो कैटेगराइज एज ऑयल सीड्स जो नेक्स्ट चैप्टर में इंक्लूडेड होगा ओके सो ये जो रेड ग्राम बंगाल ग्राम इट्स नथिंग बट जो लोकली हम लोग घर में बोलते हैं तूर मसूर उड़द दाल ये सब वो ही है दीज आर द इंग्लिश नेम्स फॉर इट ओके सो गोइंग फॉरवर्ड आप अगर वो ही पेज पे देखोगे तो नीचे देर इज अज टेबल सो यू कैन जस्ट गो थ्रू इट ठीक है अगर आपको कौन से कौन से समझना है कि कौन से कौन से लेग्यूम्स है कौन से बीन्स है कौन से पीज है तो यू कैन अंडरस्टैंड फ्रॉम इट ओके सो गोइंग फॉरवर्ड कंपोजिशन एंड न्यूट्रिटिव वैल्यू सो टू अंडरस्टैंड के पल्सेज आपको क्या देता है यू नीड टू अंडरस्टैंड द कॉम्पोजिशन एंड न्यूट्रिटिव वैल्यू ऑफ इट ओके सो अभी हम ये समझेंगे के एनर्जी कितना देता है सो एनर्जी पल्सेस गिव्स अराउंड 340 कैलोरीज ऑफ कैलोरीज बेसिकली पर 100 ग्राम्स ऑफ पल्सेस ओके एंड इट इस ऑलमोस्ट इक्विवेलेंट टू सीरियल सो अगर सीरियल में भी आप देखोगे और पल्सेस में भी देखोगे सेम कैलोरी दोनों प्रोवाइड करते हैं Carbohydrates, so it contains about 55 to 60 percent of starch, so a huge number of uh, percentage of uh, nutrition is carbohydrates. Okay, so if you make a diet plan, banate ho, you can actually calculate the carbohydrate aspirate, okay, which includes soluble, fiber, uh, soluble sugar fibers, unavailable carbohydrates are present. Uh, the unavailable sugars in pulses include substantial levels of oligosaccharides of, of the mentioned family. So, uh, oligosaccharides are basically uh, the multiple chain uh, saccharides. Okay? Uh, and baad mein uska description diya hai, so you can just go through it. But basic understanding is that in carbohydrate, mein 55 to 60% starch. Hota hai. Okay? Um, जो शुगर्स मेंशन किया है, इट आल्सो ड्यू टू द प्रेजेंस ऑफ ओलिंगोसैकराइड्स, इट एक्चुअली मेक्स अ पर्सन हैज फ्लैटुलेंस, सो यू नीड टू अंडरस्टैंड दैट इफ अ पर्सन इज कंप्लेनिंग अबाउट फ्लैटुलेंस, यू डीन नॉट गिव टू मच ऑफ पल्सेस इनटू इट, ओके? गोइंग फॉरवर्ड प्रोटीन, Okay, so make sure that whenever you're making a vegetarian diet plan, you can actually incorporate a lot of pulses in it. Okay, uh, here mentioned kiya gaya hai that kitna percentage is, so about 20 to 25 percent uh, is protein in uh, the pulses. Okay, uh, and it is chiefly described as globulins. So you can read more about globulins, you can google about it. 
okay and you can understand why it is so important okay uh, going forward next page pe पेज नंबर 73 में एक डिटेल डिस्क्रिप्शन है कि कौन सी दाल में कितना न्यूट्रिशन है तो आप बस गो थ्रू कर सकते हो यू नीड नॉट रिमेंबर इट बट यू नीड टू हैव एन अंडरस्टैंडिंग ऑन हाउ इट इज ओके गोइंग फॉरवर्ड पेज नंबर 74 पे फैट पल्सेस कंटेंट्स 1.5 परसेंट ऑफ फैट ओके व्हिच इज वेरी लेस सो नथिंग टू वरी अबाउट इन टर्म्स ऑफ फैट but it contains essential fatty acids which is very important so if you want to incorporate essential fatty acids in someone's diet if you want to reduce cholesterol etc to aap pulses add kar sakte ho okay going forward minerals so pulses mein minerals bhi hota hai vitamins kills antioxidants so minerals mein kaun se kaun se minerals hai calcium magnesium zinc iron potassium and phosphorus okay uh, uska bhi description mention kiya hai ki processing such as cooking soaking and fermentation can reduce or eliminate the amounts of phytins so phytins are also available uh, in um, pulses so uh, make sure that you know you handle the pulse properly so that your sara nutrition jaye na vitamins mein it's an excellent source of b complex and we know ki b complex uh, vitamin kafi fragile hota hai so you know you need to take care of the handling um and also uh, it is mentioned specifically like cereals they do not contain any vitamin a or c okay so isliye legume mein is an excellent source of b complex so you need to mention b complex properly so agar aap vitamins mention kar rahe ho don't be very vague case mein vitamins hai you, if you mention ke b complex bhi hai so people would understand ke aapko iske bare mein understanding hai trace antioxidants hai and then after that uh, mention kiya hai glycemic index it's a low gi food what is a gi food it means that it slowly releases energy in the body which means slow rise in blood sugar so if you are ma- making a diabetic diet plan make sure that incorporate pulses low gi food usme incorporate karna padta hai okay going forward so uh, this is basically how it is digestibility of pulses so this is on page number 75 so why this is important to know that many people actually protein in digestion hota hai bahut sare logon ko aajkal since we are in the field uh, and you know kafi zyada logon se hum log milte hain and you know we plan a lot of diets we know that protein in digestion carbohydrates in digestion ye bahut common hai logon mein so you need to know the reason why okay so the pulse protein have a higher molecular weight and the compact molecules that reduce digestion okay so it makes uh, the enzymes in your body aapke body mein basically enzymes ki requirement hoti hai koi bhi cheez ko break down karne ke liye so agar koi bhi complex molecule ya compact structure hai uh, uh, molecule ka so it gets very difficult for the enzymes to break it uske wajah se bhi bahut bar low in digestion ke wajah se it causes indigestion okay uh, pulses like rajma or kabuli chana are major examples jiske wajah se kafi flatulence ho jata hai logon mein uh, there is also a reason that it's uh, there is a presence of trypsin inhibitor okay so what what is trypsin inhibitor this is rajma mein specifically yahan pe mention kiya hai Uh, the highest in trypsin inhibitor content the reason for low digestibility in that the globular fracture in phaseulus vulgaris is not easily digested so basically it's an inhibitor so it's an enzyme which inhibits its activity that is why it causes in digestion okay uh, protein is and also whenever we uh make a balance me uh, make a meal usually protein ke sath carbohydrates ka content bhi zyada hai and pulses as such has good amount of carbohydrates so that is why it also complexes the digestion okay so this is how it is uh, there is also a brief uh, factors that reduce in digest uh, digestibility in pulses which contains pulse proteins have higher molecular weight and compact molecular to, uh, molecules to reduce digestibility jo maine mention kiya presence of trypsin inhibitor which also reduces its digestibility some proteins are complexed uh, with carbohydrates some proteins are complexed with phytins 
and digestibility of pulses uh, have a range of 50 to 62 percent so aap samajh sakte ho ki majority time protein can have in digestion issue so make sure that you take in properly with the right and balanced amount of meal so here i am ending the introduction of pulses going forward we will have processing milling jo hai wo important hai ye chapter mein to hum log wo padhenge and if at all uh, and also parboiling etc kafi terms hai yahan par jo aapko malum hone chahiye so i'll give you an understanding on them as well okay so thank you so much for your time if you have any doubts question queries definitely aap message kar sakte ho and uh, going forward i'll make sure ke videos kafi regular ho so that aap acche se padhai karo okay so thank you so much and if you have any doubts do let me know message me in the comment section and also please subscribe uh, inform your friends also about it so that aapki padhai aur acche se ho aur agar kuch bhi aapko specific topic chahiye koi bhi chapter ka to you can let me know about that as well so that i can make sure that wo main incorporate kare thank you so much for your time thank you bye bye